All right, hi Pisces. This is gonna be your mini message um, for October 2021. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Place people where they need to be. Um, if I'm speaking to you and you feel like it's not applying to you, but it's applying to someone or people you are dealing with, then just reverse the roles as need be. Remember, time is fluid, so this may be something that already happened um, currently going on or will be. Um, yes, so just, you know, keep that in mind. Take what resonates, leave what doesn't, and yeah, <laughs> and happy Tuesday. All right, so let's go. Ooh, your energy, Pisces. The hangman. Car fell, y'all. But you know, I'm looking a mess right now. <laughs> it was a Nine of Pentacles. <laughs> um, what is going on for Pisces for October 2021? So we got some conflict. Um, Pisces, I feel like with the hangman in reverse, normally when he's in the upright, as this is his natural position. This is um, someone taking the time to see a situation in a different way, whether this is you or someone else. This is um, someone um, being willing to take a different perspective and a different look at things from all angles. Upright, I feel like this is somebody, whether this is you or, you know, again, place people where they need to be. I feel like this could be you or someone refusing to see us. You guys, somebody could be refusing um, to see something for what it is right we do have conflict here it's too many people it's too much stuff in this equation it's too much going on right now a little too much so be mindful of arguments be mindful of fights um be mindful of like competitive energy um jealousy anything like that be mindful of anyone that may be trying to take you out of your element right again he's in reverse so be careful with that this could be co-workers a spouse your damn kids even shit um this could be people on the train the bus just you know again mercury retrograde people people are gonna be trying to people are gonna be trying to um people are gonna be trying to just take people out of their element during this time so be mindful of that okay um, yes, your energy again. This is um, you guys and Cancer in reverse. The High Priestess in reverse. So again, somebody could be keeping a secret, whether this is you or someone else. Somebody's not being honest. The High Priestess in the upright is very intuitive. She's not a liar per se. Like she keeps her, you know, she got one hand um kind of she, you know, she kind of hides her cards. And it's nothing and it's not it, when it's in the upright, it's not a bad thing, but when it's in reverse, it's like to somebody that's being very sneaky and keeping secrets. Or just somebody that's sneak that has very sneaky um behavior. Again, this could be you or someone you're dealing with. Oh, nine of wands. Yeah, I feel like some of you guys, um, oh, fuck, sorry, my camera, my little thingy broke, okay, do it like that, um, yeah, Knight of, Wand, Knight of Wands, yeah, some of, this could be you or, I don't know, just, I don't know. So, um, be careful with like 
I don't know. I was just telling people in a collective message, be mindful of sex during this time. I just, I don't know. Be careful who you're engaging in that with. The devil card flipped out. A lot of toxicity going on. Um, yeah, five of cups. Yeah, this is, again, somebody, this is regret. This is regret. This is sadness and regret over the past. Stuff that has spilt milk, things that already happened. This is, I don't know if this is you or someone. Or I feel like somebody doesn't see because of their ways that they're going to end up missing out on something or someone or maybe it already happened. Um, yeah, two of pentacles reverse. Yeah, some of you guys at this time could be feeling very energetically out of balance. Some of you guys could be feeling you know, the two of pentacles doesn't just talk about money it's about the you know it's also energy our bodies um our stuff so a lot of you guys again be mindful of people trying to knock you off your balance and the upright this person is doing well juggling with what, what they need to their day-to-day -day activities their money themselves their energy but in reverse with this five of wands again be mindful of things throwing you off your course throwing you out of your element pisces be very mindful of that especially this is people coming to you with gossip like office gossip friend gossip don't let other people's burdens or stuff throw you off remember when you come you're 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 a sign that's very sensitive when you come home at the end of the day make sure you're not carrying another person's burdens or conflicts that they experience throughout the day that's not your problem excuse me they got nothing to do with you Right, unless it's like your kids, and even after a certain age, shit, they gotta figure that out themselves. I don't know. <laughs> um, but don't let anything throw you off. And the death card, yeah. I feel like because somebody was caught lying. Ooh, Lord, and we got the tower. This showed up and said, ooh, hold on. The the tower and then the three of swords here and then the fucking um, hermit. Some of y'all got fucking ghosted or somebody um, not talking to your ass. Or this is vice versa. Again, take what resonates, leave what doesn't. Some parts of the message made. And this is also Virgo's energy. So you may find something shocking out about a virgo or they could be finding that out about you or and this is also aries and scorpio here too but the three of swords is not nice that's like that's like a like, that's a stab in the heart somebody could be feeling really like heartbroken yeah again ten of wands this is somebody yeah this is very stressful when you or someone but that's what you get for lying right people get for lying because look we have the high priestess here and the death card so because somebody was in this sneaky ass energy, somebody got deaded. The death card here, Scorpio energy. Somebody got broken up with, somebody got left on red. I don't know, somebody is, something ended. Something is coming to an end. So, you know, this is, and we're also in Libra season. This is not the time to lie. I wouldn't, I wouldn't be lying right now if I were y'all. So, I don't know, Pisces, that, I don't know, I don't like this High Priestess in Reverse. I don't like the High Priestess in Reverse. So, whether this is you lying or this is someone else that was lying, but somebody was lying here. So there's a lot of secrets and then the Five of Wands here as well. And this was somebody that was trying to, like, juggle multiple people at once or multiple things whether this is um people or things or just 
too much responsibilities, too much. It, it, it became just unbalanced. It became too much. And make sure, again, during this Mercury retrograde, especially and for Libra season, mind, I was, I'm telling everybody, if it comes up, mind your words. Be careful what you say to people, how you say it, because it can't, it can throw, the, it can throw something completely off course. But I would say just do not lie during this time. If somebody else is lying to you, that's their business, not yours. But, you know, there's going to be a lot of emotional regret and pain here for that. Okay? So, just be mindful, Pisces. Mm, yeah. There's no air. There's no air energy here. Or oh, there's wands, cups, and pentacles. So... You know, you guys may not be in the right state of mind at this time. Um, you guys may be feeling a little thrown off. Again, the Mercury retrograde is not the time to be trying to do too many things at once. Because it's gonna it can really throw you it can really throw your energy off. It throw your finances off, your energy off, all that. So um yeah, be mindful of that. Yeah. Um, yeah, be mindful. But the tower, this came up in Sagittarius' reading as well. The tower card. But yeah, three of swords here. Somebody definitely could have been trying to um, balance more than one person or more than one thing. And somebody got, some again, somebody, again, this is Libra season. It's not the time to lie. Things are, A lot of things are going to be exposed during this retrograde this retrograde is going to be exposing a lot of stuff about people and just about things so but you know with the death card here the there is the light at the end of the tunnel you know you live and you learn people live and learn um yeah that's i hope this i feel like this was like kind of all over the place but that's what i feel like the energy is um, this I feel like this is a pretty specific message. So this may not resonate with um, every Pisces or most uh, you guys who normally watch this. Um, so just keep that in mind. I feel like this is very um, specific. And thing with tarot, it kind of gets very it's pre it gets pretty specified. That's why I like to do the oracle messages more because it's a little bit more broad. Um, but tarot, it can it's it's a story. Tarot tells us a story. So all stories are not going to fit. Um, but again, try not to let your energy get thrown off by other people's conflicts and issues. Again, even this is you, uh, this could be a co-worker, a boss, you riding a train or bus. Just don't let nothing get to you. And again, you guys may not be seeing what the, I just realized this with the hangman in reverse. You know, he's busy worrying about these cups that spilled, right? But he's not seeing the two cups that are up right behind him. So try not to focus too much on what's not working, what hasn't worked, the past. You still got these two cups standing behind you. And that could be what you're having a hard time seeing at this time, Pisces. Okay? Not all is lost. Not all hope is lost. Whether it's about love, health, finances, it's not nothing. Nothing is all lost. Okay, especially with the tower here, divine intervention. And this may be something that hurts, right? It's maybe something that hurts, and it may send you into this, like, hermit-like energy. But you'll move forward, okay? Because it's better to move forward than to be in this burdensome space. You don't want that. Um, I hope this helps, Pisces. Um, be mindful of gossip, too. You, you know, again, don't get sucked into people telling you other people's business and things. I know it's juicy and it's entertaining, but that shit can become very addictive and very draining. And it's like once you, like, tap into it, it's kind of hard to stop. So just be mindful of any, like, office gossip or things like that. Okay? Um. So, yeah, I hope this helps, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye!